Hi, I'm Dr. Jim Gimble, president of Concordia Lutheran Seminary, Edmonton. Today we introduce Catherine Von Pora, also known as Katie Luther. Katie was placed by her parents into the care of the nuns at age six. She took her own vows at age 16. Life as a nun held long days of hard work just to live. Katie heard Luther's teaching about freedom in the gospel. Her decision to leave influenced other nuns. Katie and the other newly Lutheran nuns escaped the nunnery in 12 empty herring barrels. Luther found husbands for the other nuns and finally was convinced to marry Catherine himself in 1526. He was 42 and she was 26. Katie was a grand homemaker, raising a garden and animals for meat, cooking, cleaning, brewing beer and hosting many guests. Luther said, there is no more lovely, friendly and charming relationship, communion or company than a good marriage. Katie encouraged, defended, and trusted Luther amid difficulty, referring to him often as Dr. Luther. He had many pet names for her, but frequently simply called her My Dear Kate. After Luther died, Catherine wrote, For who could not be deeply grieved and saddened over the loss of such a dear and precious man as my husband? That's today's Reformation Minute.